anymore, so all this stuff works. Lock, unlock, uh, alarm. It does have a silencer in it right now that they uh, had, and it does have some stuff on it, uh, like that a D Max sticker, and so they do have some extra stuff on it. And I do get um, gauges and different things like that, but uh, yeah. I take out the silencer, obviously, it'd be like really loud. It's, and it is very, I have taken it out, it is extremely loud, but rowdy. Yeah, I can uh, take off other stuff or whatever if you ask, or, and you want to change some stuff up or whatever. The only thing that I know with this right now, it has a boost leak right here. Um, it's a little bit dented up, so what I'm planning to do is have it um, have it welded up. But it does hold boost extremely well. They had some uh, like Japanese steel tape on it, and then I just kind of cleaned it up with some uh, duct tape stuff just to make sure everything stays. I haven't lost any pressure with it, but of course, you know, as always, you want to have it welded up. Um, which, like I said, I mean, we can always do stuff here. Uh, yeah. Japanese battery still good um, extremely well uh, cranking amps on it like there's no issues um, Grady temp sensor for the most part you can use just about I, I've used quite a bit of temp sensors I haven't tested this one yet uh, I know it works but I haven't actually put one of my own uh, gauges on it but you could probably always get like a, uh, another gauge or I can look up some pro sport or some blitz gauges for you if you want um, yeah Sox twin turbo uh, you know, you can always adjust things if you need to, uh, but very, very helpful.